That should bring the game back. And the cam. There. So, this happens too. Yeah, my favorite part though is that if that's the wrong bit boss. It's not the one that's actually on my screen. Um, that's an old one. It's not saving the information for whatever reason. I don't understand why. But, alright, we're gonna run with that. I'm gonna hope that this is, because it's halfway through the show, hopefully that means it's not gonna be an issue I'll be able to get through the rest of the stream without it being a problem. But we'll find out, I guess. Um, examine, attack, examine... Examine again. It's just, it's really annoying that I have to do that. And I've reported this issue numerous times. It's, it's getting to the point where it's actually starting to get a little too frustrating because it doesn't seem like anybody's interested in this. Um, and that bothers me a little bit. Like, I understand they are working on some things, but... Like, certain things, they come find me and say, Hey, how did this happen? Or what happened with this situation with this? But with this, they've just, I don't know, ignored it or something? I don't know. So... I'm going to be a, try to be a little bit more insistent on it. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I don't know. I don't think I am. But it's, it's starting to become super frustrating where I actually have to take the stream down to bring it back. Oh, really? Okay. I did not know it was a common issue. Because I've never seen anybody report it but me. That's the problem. Um, if I'd seen somebody else report it, I would've said, oh, okay, someone else has already got this and they're working on it. Okay. Yeah, I try to pop into the bug area, but I, I can't see everything. Like, because there's just so much. Especially since there's so many people streaming with the software, so... Yeah, I've got too many discords to keep track of, so I can't look at all of them all the time. Seriously, man? Nope, it's there. It should be there now. Yeah, it's not there the whole time. Um, it should be disappearing. Messages should be scrolling off after about 30 seconds, I think. Should be emphasis on that so um yeah they gotta figure out a way to get chat on here if they're supposed to be taking stream labs, labs out of this and i'm number one heck yeah nice um i'm actually surprised there are other people streaming this game it's great but it's like it's it's what i would consider a really obscure game You just go to the browse and look for the game and just see how many people pop up. That's all it is. It's this is just such a super obscure game. I'm just very surprised. Alright, this is the last turn, I think, right? Yep, okay, so let's see how we did. It's Friday between 6 to midnight. Fortunately, I will never be here for that because I work on Fridays. Um, I, I, well, I guess I actually have to ask what time zone that's for. But if that's 6 to midnight Eastern, I will never be here for that. Which sucks. But it might be because somebody who's famous is playing the game as a first playthrough or something like that. And just their whole channels come with them. Alright, well, there's some more attack power. That actually didn't 
help as much as I thought it was going to. 6 to 12 Central still won't be around. Well, actually, I'll take that back. I'll be around for that last hour because I'll be able to play from... Because I'll get home and start my stream at 12, which will be 11 o'clock Central. So... That's all right. The whole point of playing this month was to do some obscure stuff, things that you know people may not have seen, but they're fun to watch and are fun to play. So, all right, I'm gonna try one more run of training, and then we're gonna make another shot at this. All right. So, how do we do this? Okay, so it's actually going to tell me how to make him defend. Here's how it works. First of all, to raise my defense, attack me when I'm defending, like this. How do I make you defend? My defense will go up according to the number of times I'm attacked. Yeah, I'm trying to buff him. I don't have a whole lot of buffs to give him, unfortunately. Well, uh, dude, you, you don't defend. That's been my problem. I was hoping you were going to tell me how to make you defend, because... Yeah. Um, I gave him the best stuff I could buy. A moon blade and... What is it? Scale mail? How you doing tonight, man? Yeah, I like doing obscure games because they're a little more interesting. I am going to be doing something a little bit more... Maybe not mainstream, but something that's a little more popular after I'm done with this. Ah. Uh, I was afraid it was going to be something like that because that's difficult to maintain. Okay, let's see. be done. Mm. Nice. Good crit. Good crit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think I was going to be able to beat him. I actually, because from what I'm, I'm seeing, Zig actually does not have a ton of health. Yeah. I think I might. I'm gonna switch out Gar for that. Uh, wait, I gotta talk to. I gotta talk to him to do the switch out. Um, we'll switch out Gar because Gar is just kind of an accident waiting to happen with his reprisals. To be honest. All right, so let's give this a shot. We'll do what I did before with the protect. What do you got to work with? Blunt. We'll throw a weekend on Ryu. We will throw Protect on you, and you just have your, your own stuff. Okay. So we get a little more damage. Alright. Okay, a bit more damage, better. Oh, reprisals, not good. Reprisals are not my friend. Um, 
I think we're gonna leave the rest of that stuff alone. Let's do a whack. Protect, and we'll hit a, we'll do a rejuve. I would imagine it does because double strike in every other instance is treated as two attacks. It, can, it has separate misses, it has separate critical rules, so I would imagine it does. We'll find out, I guess. There we go. Alright, um, let's go to another protect on him. I'm just gonna... This whack. So now if I can get him low, now I can use Nina to just kind of wail on him. No, not Nina. All right, protect. Um, I'm gonna do a shot and a no crit. Okay, there we go. I'm going to defend with Momo, attack with Ryu. I'm going to need to heal Nina in just a minute. Uh, we'll attack, because I think he might start guarding now. We're going to heal Nina. And I'm going to guard. Yep, yep. So now Nina can just sit there and whack him. Oof. Or she's not going to be able to do enough damage to get through. Actually, wait. Blunt on Ryu. I don't think she can do enough damage because of the zero thing. I'm gonna try the double blow now. Yeah, actually... I think I'll be okay. After the blunt goes off, I should be okay. Or... I could be in trouble, maybe. <laughs> Actually, does it does it require you to take damage, or does it just require to be attacked? I might be in trouble if I can't do damage to him. Because I don't think I can do enough damage to him now. I'm not sure either. I'm, I'm kind of curious now, because I could be in trouble if it doesn't. I'll give him a tiny heal. Well, actually, it's going to be like half his health, but... Yeah, I don't think I can do enough damage. And by enough damage, I mean any damage. I'm going to see if Momo can punch through that. She might. Oh, there we go. Got some damage. Oh, we stopped defending. Because he stopped defending, I think. So I might have gone overboard with some of that. Maybe shouldn't have done the blunt. Um, not currently. I don't have access to might. Oh, Jesus, a critical did that little. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, let's see. You should defend, yep. Nothing, yeah. I buffed his defense, and then I debuffed my attack power for Ryu. There we go. Okay, so I can use Ryu to just attack. Yeah. 
Yeah. So reuse. Okay, maybe he's not gonna get through. I would think that this should level up his defense because he's defending pretty darn good. Cool. There we go. There's a little bit of damage. So I've hit him like twice or three times with damage when he's defending. All the rest have just been zeros. I actually probably could shoot him with Momo, too, and it probably wouldn't matter. Oh, there's an outright miss. Plus his charge. <laughs> Thanks, Momo. There we go. There's some damage. Oh, Momo can still do damage. Okay. So I probably could have been fine with just using the Protect a couple of times. Okay. Good job. You got him, Nina. <laughs> Alright, let's find out how much defense he ended up with. Okay, so the zeros did count. That's a lot of defense. That is good to know. Alright, so I think it is going to be worth... So it doesn't matter, it's just, it's, it's got to be some sort of... It can't be a miss, but it's got to be... It's got to show up as damage. So I'm going to see if I can try to get him to win this time, because... He's been gaining power steadily, and that was a huge jump in defense. Like, 25 points of defense is huge. That's like going from no armor to, like, the best current armor I can get. So, let's try this out. Alright. Hopefully this works. And the chat froze again. Um, let's try a reset. Probably not going to fix it, but we're going to find out. If it doesn't start working, I think I'm just going to have to leave it. Because I've tried deleting and re-adding the source before, and that doesn't seem to help. Yada, yada, yada. We know it's a duel. Not going to say it again. I don't think we need to help him. I think he's going to be able to cover this on his own. I feel like Bade's got this. I feel like he's got it. That was a good amount of damage. Yeah, he's got this. He's got this. It's gonna take like 10 attacks or something like that, but he's got this. No, this is just a gimme. Oh, okay. That hurt a little bit. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. He's still got this. He's way ahead on damage, I'm pretty sure. Oh, wow. These lucky strikes are getting a little vicious. Oh, 
when he's waving, supposedly I can use things to heal him. Let's find out. Yeah, it worked. Okay. Oh, that was it. Except for if those lucky strikes hadn't happened, it would have just been a runaway. I... I won! Oh no, boss! I don't believe it. How could big old Ziggier lose to Bade? Bade? Are you alright? Look at you. You're all beat up. If I hadn't been for all your help, I wouldn't have been able to beat Zig. If you hadn't convinced me to fight, Zig, Ryu, then... I guess... I would have stayed the same old babe, a 98-pound weakling. Shadis, I want to help you. Let's take care of the guild, together. Boss! Boss! Did you hear that? Boss! Boss! Wake up, boss! Thank you. Thank you so very much. I don't know what'll happen next, but... Shadis and I will work everything out somehow, together. Yay! Happy endings for all. Alright, I'm gonna... Alright, I'm gonna... I'll try deleting and re-ending the source just to make sure. I just... That seems like an awful lot of effort to go through to get this to work. Okay, we'll try that. Alright, so we're back to the wharf. And it's still up there, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is. Wow. Dude, that is just... It's persisting even through the... Even through removing the source. Got a... Crepe Cape. Okay. And a Claymore. Claymore is supposed to be a really solid weapon, though it's slow. Yeah, it is. I'm not sure if it's worth it. Um... Nice, I'll go with that. Yeah, I don't know what to do about the, about the source other than just restarting entirely. Seriously. Oh, hello. Thank you so much for everything. These injuries? Well, I'm not used to fighting, see, so... Ouch. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know either. It, it's working fine on my end with, with the preview, but just it's not going out to the stream. So I won't be going to the lighthouse for a while, I suppose. But if you're really in a hurry, I really shouldn't do this. You're not guild members, but... I was wondering... Would you help us fix the lighthouse? Here, take this. I got something. You got a guild badge. Only seven more to get to the Pokemon League. With that, you can get to the lighthouse. I don't know for sure if the ship 
will come back once the lighthouse has been fixed, but it can't hurt to try, right? No, no it can't. I do need to report. Actually, I think I can just exit, because this will exit to the world map, I think. Right? Maybe? I think it does. Wait a minute, please. Only guild members are allowed past this point. You have a badge? <laughs> yes. Uh... Oh, yeah, he, he could definitely be Brock. Though he's not the ladies' man that Brock is. But speaking of Brock, I was so annoyed when I heard about the uh, the new movie. They took out Brock and Misty. It's like, you know what? No, you can't have a remake of the original without Brock and Misty. Sorry. Thanks for playing. Oh, uh, wait. I need the ally. We're going to grab Gar. <laughs> Maybe, yeah, I guess. I can't camp here. Damn. Oh well. Lighthouse! Oh, here we go. Let the battles commence. Ghost. Uh, ghosty ghost. Uh, can I actually hit it? It might have more evasion, but I'm pretty sure I'll be able to hit it. Or it could probably just live. Wait, what? <laughs> Should I really switch to Paco? He's really underleveled. Yeah, I don't really like onions. That that is true. I don't like onions. Here. Oh, battle. Thunder. They're just gonna heal themselves, right? Yeah. I did not have an apprentice at level one, unfortunately. I have an apprentice at like level five. So, I can go back and get them. I've just never really used him before, like ever. And I mean ever. So we'll take a look. This would, I guess, be a decent place to get him some levels because Momo and Ryu should actually be able to, to carry him a little bit. He's got almost as much health as Momo does, and he's like, he's less than half the level. He's like almost a third the level, and he's got almost as much health, so we'll try it. Go, go, onion thing. This is a really weak enemy, anyway. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Uh, I'm sure they killed a lot of dragons that were related to Ryu. There, oh, there's a couple of... Oh, there's a bunch of chests down there. Okay, nothing in that corner. Alright. Go this way.
Okay, ghosts. I did not know that either. No sleepy. No sleepy is, is good sleepy. Okay, if I have to pick one, Pekka is the best solution to that question. No more sleepy. Oh, you suck. Uh. Wake the other ones up. I don't know. Is it, just, is it just me, or does it not make sense that magic doesn't wake people up? Like, I'm sorry, you just got buffeted by a cyclone. Or you got burned. You don't wake up? I was struggling to figure out what Momo could do with her math ability. But I couldn't remember. Alright. Ten. Oh, yikes. Got a wisdom seed. Nice. So, what's down here? Anything? Not much. So what is the purpose of this side path? Anything? Oh, okay. It's gonna loop me around. Got it. Um, well, let's just do a charge. Okay, so the bolt just got powered up. Can we kill the bolt? Don't increase it again. Oh, good. Go, Paco, go! Nice! And he'll level up quicker as I go, so... Alright, is there something back there? No. Is something back there. Swallow Eye. That will increase somebody's agility by one, if I remember. Thank you. Anything? Oh, is this the way in? Was this the only way to get in? Lighthouse employees, please read the following. Uh, there's extra Chrysum ore stored outside the lighthouse. Oh, is that what's in those boxes? The boiler in the basement can be fired up by placing chrysum ore in it. Read the valve. Wait for the pressure to stabilize, then open the main valve. Vaporized chrysum will begin to flow through the ducts. Which ducts the chrysum flows through can be regulated with the switch valves. If there's no more chrysum, get some from the shop in Rapala that sells chrysum ore. So 
If I yeah, I think I thought so. I, if I remember right, you can use Momo's ad uh, extra weapons to power it still as well. So like you can use the ice and flame chrysum that she gets. But I'm guessing those steel boxes that are outside are also going to have some. We will find out though. Okay, you got this, Momo. Ah, oh, disappointed. Hit. Yeah. Actually, no, we'll keep going this way. What's down here? It's just one of the switch valves, okay. Hmm, these are mean if I remember. Is that like, that's like a demi style move, right? Or did that take did that take AP? I think it did. Nice, good crit, good crit. Oop, only one. Reach power. Take health or I'm not sure what that did. There we go, good job. Oh, those would be good to level up on, because they're worth 50 each. Here. This place is huge. This should lead me out to that little tiny courtyard with the boxes in them. Yep. Flame Chrysom. Flame Chrysom. Flame Chrysom. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm supposed to use the flame chrysum. Big damage. Not big damage. <laughs> Tries again. Hey, thank you for the follow, Aaron. Really appreciate it. No idea why I played twice. All right, pack. Of oh wow, he just got a crap ton of stuff. Holy cats. Nice. Um, it would help if I had paid attention to where the heck I was going. I think it was not this way. Oh, those are beautiful stats. I wish I could get those stats more often on level ups. Oh, I probably should have healed too. Oh, this could go very badly. No. No. Okay. Okay. Air raid doesn't hurt me at all because I'm not actually trying to do moves. 
Paco is just gonna keep healing. The air raid is the annoying part, I think. I earned the double follow. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Nice increase in damage. I like how Paco's the only one who's in decent health right now. And you heal yourself, Paco. Go to town. Resist shots. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know you're talking about. Yeah, that probably would have been a good idea if I thought about it. But I didn't, so there. We'll just do it the old-fashioned way. Through Vim and Vigor. So, with Paco's regeneration, is that based off of a percentage of his max health or something? Because it seems to. Either that or it's based off his level, because it now it's gone up to five. It used to be four. Now it's five. Nice. You know what I also should have done? I should have remembered to apprentice Momo to a master, because I'm pretty sure Momo doesn't have one. Yeah. Momo doesn't have a master. I've seen a lot of different people say that Momo can be taken a bunch of different ways. I almost think it might be worth running out of here to go get some things and then get Momo a master. Delonzo, 10% accuracy. I don't think I have enough weapons to do Delonzo though. I kind of want to take her in a caster direction, to be honest. Um, so I'm not sure what's better to just grab, um, what's his name, the old wizard, or see about grabbing, um, see if I can get to Amitai yet, wherever he is. I don't know, because I kind of want to have a caster for when I'm getting into fights where I need magic. I kind of want to build an, a nice all-around team. Uh, Momo has a lot of really powerful buffs and debuffs that are worth using. Um, I just want to have something that's a little more well-rounded. But I can try Delonzo if I've got enough weapons. That's my problem, I'm not sure if I do. Get wrecked. Get double wrecked, maybe. No. Nice. Go away. That is really cool. Say 10% accuracy would be pretty cool to be honest because um, I've already got the Artemis cap on her, so it improves her accuracy somewhat, so it makes her a little less aggravating, we'll call it. Um, 
let's actually let's take a look at what I have for what if I can even get Delonzo. I don't think I have the weapons for it to be honest. Alright. I just noticed that's basically a palette swap of Shadows. Eagdrazzle. Okay. Now, can I get to Eagdrazzle at this point? Is it just Pekos required, or do I need to be adult? I don't think I've ever apprenticed to Geek Drazzle before. Ever. Gotcha, so it has to be with Pekka. but okay. No, we're good. Do I need to... I'll just rest at the end here. Because because I'm thinking, wait, the inoculation wears off when you rest, doesn't it? Am I renting my room to an onion? I'll just rest here. Hopefully I've got enough for the inoculation still. I've got 1,025. Rest first before taking drugs. Excellent. Good idea. That's that's um, that's definitely a PSA for the rest of the uh, the stream. First shot before you get on the boat. Yeah. against those nasty, nasty sleep spells. Make things a lot easier for me to deal with.
oh, this didn't, this is transitioned to the next area as opposed to putting me to the world map. This, you know, this will put me to the world map, I think. Yep. Everybody's got a master. You jerk. Thunder, and you just get jolt on me. Cool. Oh, I didn't see that chest before. A coin. I already got one, but okay. Bolt, also weak. Worth like no experience. Alright, almost back inside. Important question, how the heck does Pekko get up a ladder? <laughs> no worries. Yeah, it happens. I, I put streams on, like, I'll go into lurk mode, whatever, and just, I'll play another game while I'm, while I'm kind of half-heartedly checking in a stream. Um, you know, mostly because I like to show support for other small streamers and too because, you know, I need to have more than one thing going on in a lot of cases, otherwise I get bored. And man, up oh, there's a host from Trash Panda Gur. Thank you so much, Trash, for the host. I really appreciate it. And everybody, welcome to the stream from Trash Panda's backyard. Welcome to the bonfire. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be playing. I, I got this awesome command I made for Nightbot that's kind of neat. Uh, I don't get to use it that much because Trash is like the only person that hosts me, but... What? It didn't work. Bastards. Okay, apparently my, my, um, my command is not working. But everybody should go follow Trash Panda because he's a really good streamer. Um, he was doing Empyrean Galactic Survival on his stream tonight, which is a really neat um, sandbox building game with space stuff. Uh, how you doing tonight, Trash? How'd your stream go? Go good? Ah, there we go. There's the uh, there's the uh, host thing. 3D Starbound. Yeah, that's a pretty good way to describe it. Awesome, awesome. Glad to hear it, man. You leave my AP alone. Uh, no sleep, no sleep. 
Yeah! Oh, oh, miss. And I got so many people in the stream. It's awesome. Always love it when I see chat hopping, people going back and forth. Makes things so much more fun. Alright, that's some good experience, I think, right? There we go. There's a level for Pekko. Not bad. He's gonna be pretty tanky. I just gotta get down to the basement. Uh, let's see. Oh, there we are. Yeah, I, I actually, the SC Discord has just kind of fallen off my radar for a lot of cases, just because I just, I just don't have time or the ability to keep up, unfortunately. All right, opening the main valve. Wait for the curve on the pressure graph to stabilize. When the pressure hits the apogee of the center of the graph, pull the lever. If there's not enough pressure, or if it's not stabilized, the boiler will stop. So when I saw these instructions the first time around, I had no idea what the hell an apogee was. Uh, place another chunk in and start over. So like, I had no idea what an apogee was. That didn't work. Oh, you suck. I had it. something like that. It's like you, you couldn't have used a different word to communicate you wanted it to be at the top. Got ourselves a boss coming up, though. Okay, Momo got to 17. Momo learned speed. it is. So, so Trash, what do you think about those new first-person um, servers coming out for uh, PUBG? Sounds kind of interesting. Hey. And let me get rid of you. Okay, one more hit. 
It's gonna, it's gonna make it a whole different game. Um, you know what? I didn't go and buy any healing herbs, did I? Because I'm an idiot. Oh, I got some jerky. No, it's been strictly third person, but there, there. I guess there's some mods you can do to do. Uh, you can use to play it in third first if you want. Um, I need to go up that way. Um, but they're gonna have official first person support coming. It's kind of a neat idea. I wouldn't mind looking at it. Yeah, there's our boss up there. Well, it might be a first-person only move, um, setup then, so that you can only use first-person. I'm not sure though. Nice. All right, another five points of strength. 10 HP, not bad, not bad. Oh, there we go. Got the trigger on our event. Fair enough. Yeah, neither do I, so. What is that? It's so cute. I don't know about that wasn't there before, and that's part of my problem. So... Everybody looking okay? Some of that back. Yeah, zombie servers are coming too. Row, row. It's a really big eyeball. Okay, I got this. I can do it. Now that I think about it, it's not cute at all. Yeah, it's a little menacing. I seem to remember this fight being annoying. Um. Oh! I can do shield. Nice! Alright, you can start attacking. <laughs> yeah, it's a really nice game. Perfect. Okay, get some more defense. Because this... I don't know how it balances, but it does. Okay. Um, we're going to do... Protect on you. Cast shield again. not be physical damage or something. Maybe? Okay, so they should be capped out on their defense ops. Oh, pfft, nice. Uh -oh. Incoming damage! Possibly screwed.
I have no idea what it's weak against. I might be screwed because I just realized I don't have any ammonia. What particular form is he weak against? And I have cheese, thank you very much. I just used it. Flame, okay. Wow. We're going to go for Flame, and we're going to go for Thorn. Flame and Defender, that's really, that's it? Alright, we'll do Defender. This should also then boost, oh, please don't kill me right now. Okay, I'm okay with that, because Pekko will just heal. He's just going to tank it. Okay, I'll see how long I can stay in this. I'm going to be going with Flame Claw. Because I have a double focus on, but it should still be in effect. Oh, heck yeah. That is some good damage. Okay, so I've got another three of these I can use. I think I'll be okay. Nice. Lots of damage. Yeah, I'll have two more of these now. <laughs> what? That did like nothing. That's ridiculous. So fire or ice? Well, I actually I'm guessing. Well, Samoon is a fire spell, but Ice Blast is a higher level of magic. So my guess is that they even out because Ice Blast compensates for the no weakness by being a stronger spell. Now we'll find out. This will be my oh, miss. Nice. This will be my last flame claw. I just gotta go back to regular tag now. Oh, missed. Alright, that's that's fine. Momo's just gonna sit there sleeping. Oh, nice. Good crit, man. Good crit. Oh, you gotta stop missing, dude. You gotta stop it. Front row. Here it comes. Uh, Meditate is a magic booster. 
And Magic Ball is a spell that you get. I thought it was from Mygus, but it might be from Emetai. Yeah, I don't know. Dream Breath. That'll be interesting, I'm sure. Alright, so that should be that. Yep, and we've got the power going all the way up. And really no attacks that whole way. Wow. Let's go get that gene. That should be the Eldritch gene. Yep, there's the Eldritch gene. That'll give me some more powerful magics. And, oh, fight. Fight, fight, fight. Hi, Momo. You're, you're in trouble, aren't you? You're a siphon, Momo, aren't you? Nope. Okay, good. Probably should heal her. I'm unsure what's going on outside, but there are people that are screaming. <laughs> it is never dull in this area. Alright, you got full health. Um, with this switch, the lighthouse bulb can be turned on. Yay! Boom, boom, pow. Jesus. No! It's the very angry fairies. Turn the lighthouse off! I said turn it off! Nice job. You broke it. Oh no! Now what are we supposed to do? After we went all to all the trouble to get Geyser to guard it. Now we can't turn it off. I hate you. Dummies, it's all your fault. You'd better make up for it. Here, take this. You got a fairy tiara. Oh, don't I feel pretty now. If you use this in the flower rings out in the country, you can come to our world. You'll be in big trouble if you don't, understand? Yes. Yeah, so much what the fuck is going on. What was that all about? Heck if I know. Um, is she a decent master, though? Like, I don't, like, she does Shadow Walk, which is a good move. But I'm not sure if she's good or if she's worth um, apprenticing for like stats and stuff. So I feel like I should just go get out of here, get back to Bunyan, grab Disembowel because I'm pretty sure I've got it, and then um, switch to Merrily to try to. Uh, let's see if this works. Stats not so much. Okay, well, we'll take a look. Let's put everybody to sleep. Plus two agility is not bad, but I feel like I could probably get Swallow Eyes to make up for it. Come on, Becko. <laughs> nice job. Everybody's running. Yep. So the question becomes, is it worth 
Should I grab a skill slave for that? Or should I lose some of the stats to stick, say, um, to stick like Ryu on that? I'm thinking the skill slave is a better idea. Fight right off the ladder. Bone has the initiative. Boo. Dead. Dead Zors. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking of when I said that. I guess I've seen some people describe them as skilled dolls in this game. But HM, HM slaves show up in more than just Nuzlocke challenges. Um, like speed runs and stuff like that, they'll show up in it. It, it happens even for casual, because you got to find somebody who's going to learn all those useless skills you don't need anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Like that. Well... Yeah, we could do Gar. Because he's just a physical... He's just a physical attacker. Ryu's going to be a physical attacker. Ray will be a physical attacker. I think we'll be okay with everybody. Uh, Paco's going to be a physical attacker too, actually. Are you fighting a building? No, I'm not fighting a building. Not yet, at least. Maybe later. Oh, and look at that. The chant just magically started working again. I just noticed it started working. That's... Okay, whatever. Bebo's just gonna be weird. Alright, well, either way, I gotta get Gar off of Bunyan. <laughs> yeah, he can. I don't think it's Streamlabs, because I've never seen this problem with Streamlabs, to be honest. So, uh, But yeah, he can go back and forth. The only thing that is a problem with Ryu is just having enough AP to keep everything running. That's always my biggest issue with him. Are they that prevalent in the late game, though? Ah, uh, this is fun. Oh, are they? Okay. I couldn't remember. Uh, working hard. Ryu, you've made a lot of progress. And disembowel? Yep, okay, so Ryu's done learning skills.
I guess, oh, okay, really? Uh, is that wisdom fruit or the seeds? Oh, really? Can we just leave? Thank you. Did not know. Oh, I know the fairy village can be used for a lot of. Um, let's just call them tricks. But I did not know that you could use it for the stat boosting items. Alright, so let's get Pecco in the party. And then we'll go to Merrily. should be cheating. It's work. Uh, oh, yeah, it does look like it froze. Damn. Ah. That is interesting. Okay, well, I've got it. Um, can I? Oh, there we go. I just want to talk to you. Yeah, I don't know. It, it's almost like it's not getting information from Streamlabs. It's just really weird. Maybe that's going to be a big problem if that is the case. I guess my question is, does she take a minus to all of the stats too? Or is it just a plus to agility so you get more agility than normal? Because it doesn't make a mention to other stats going down. It just mentions that agility will go up. Um, I may as well talk to Fall along here. It, does, it is a minus to other stats, okay. So I'm pretty sure Pekko's gained a few levels, enough to get some skills. Yeah, there's 
hub. Okay. What do you want? Charge, okay. No, I don't want to quit. I think I probably got another. We'll try. We'll find out. I guess maybe. Learn resist. No. Let's see if I can get another. <clears throat> nope. Okay. No. <clears throat> All right. So I got that at least. I need to grind with Gar a little bit to get the Shadow Walk and stuff like that. Charge is Pekko's new best friend. Uh-oh. Probably see what that is then. Oh. Hello. So they are looking into it just all right as long as they're looking into it because that's been my concern is that nobody has said it like every other issue i've brought up <clears throat> um like tyler or somebody else will come up and say yeah hey um i want to check in with you about this what's happening when you do this etc etc um I don't really want to get into the fairy stuff just yet because it's going to be like a boss fight that's coming up really, really quick and I don't think I'm going to have enough time to do it before I want to end stream. Um, so I think I'm actually going to go ahead and call it quits here for tonight. Um, just so that, you know, I, you know, keep things so I don't have to cut it off in the middle of an event. I don't go too late. Um, because I do need to get a few things done tonight, unfortunately, so I can't stay later like I normally would. Um, yeah, I'll have to move those skills over at some point. Oh, appreciate everybody hanging out. Doesn't matter for how long, you know, it's it's always appreciated. So let's do a quick save here. And then we're going to play that wonderful, wonderful game where I figure out if there's anybody I can host for the evening. All right, do that. And all right. Who is floating around tonight? Anybody? Is there really nobody I'm following live right now? That's rather interesting. I don't believe that. But apparently it is true. So I guess there's nobody... I guess there's nobody here uh, that I follow that is going that is live right now, so I guess we'll just end it. <laughs> so, 
Yeah, go take a look at An- An- Angelus. You know, he, he does some pretty cool stuff with Seven Days and some other stuff. So, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. There is nobody to there, there's nobody to um, host at this point. I guess they all have better things to do at three o'clock on a Saturday, or I guess a Sunday morning. So everybody, thank you for watching. I hope you had a great time, and I will be back tomorrow night with some more. See you next time. Bye-bye.